Introduced in 2008, the blockchain is a relatively new technology. Although still in its infancy, blockchain technology has already spread to nearly every industry around the globe, from healthcare to agriculture and beyond. The blockchain is decentralized, and that means for Bitcoin, every 10 minutes, people go and validate a transaction. This sort of brand new uh, model is being taken place, and what's important always is trust. Now, all of a sudden, we're seeing millennials trusting Bitcoin. So this is a big game changer. Blockchain technology is influencing the way businesses operate in many ways because it's hitting every part of the organization from accounting, to marketing and it's going to be a hard way to avoid it moving forward. So it's either get on the bus or you'll be under the bus. Forecasts suggest that global blockchain technology revenues will experience massive growth, with the market expected to climb to more than $39 billion in size by 2025. The rapidness came from the millennials that were working on their gaming computers, getting digital coins so they could reuse them within those games. That was their first exposure to the blockchain and digital currency. So they've been very quick to adopt this a lot faster than some of the earlier generations. Building a bridge from the blockchain sector to traditional capital markets, Hive Blockchain Technologies is the world's first publicly traded firm involved in the business of mining virgin digital currencies. A couple years ago, we repositioned the companies because we really believed we had to have greater transparency and accountability. So we took control of the facilities in Sweden first, then Iceland, and then we made two acquisitions. A year ago it was in Quebec uh, for 30 megawatts, and now we're completing 50 megawatt facility campus in New Brunswick. All these operations are using green energy, either geothermal in Iceland or hydroelectricity and inexpensive. Quite often, this electricity is surplus electricity. Assuming 100% control of mining operations and management can help to improve transparency, accountability, and profitability. Right. Having complete control over our mining operations provides us a lot of insight and transparency into the operations where we're there day by day, on the ground, being able to see what's happening and being able to pivot as quickly as possible to changes in the environment. With a dedication to green power, its operations use renewable hydroelectronic and geothermal energy. At the very beginning, we recognized there was great misinformation on how much electricity is being consumed in mining cryptocurrencies. And we said, let's have a very strong ESG footprint. And ESG stands for, what's your environment? Are you protecting the environment? Are you responsible with the environment? And are you sustainable? And do you have good corporate governance? And so far, that's exactly what we've been doing. And we also give a lot back to the community in Bowdoin. These GPU chips we use to mine Ethereum are also the GPU chips that can be used for artificial intelligence, for kids, for education, and especially the digital program for uh, gaming industry. We have a three-pronged approach. So first was only hydro geothermal electricity, uh, inexpensive surplus in the area. Two was using our software in Bowdoin, Sweden, and what we do with that software is that in 15 seconds, we can go from using 20 megawatts down to one. So we tool down and it doesn't create any cost to the community. In an effort to mitigate its environmental impact, Hive is building sustainable operations that will power the blockchain of the present and the future. Hive, since it, it was started in 2017, has made sure that they are in cool climates like Canada, Sweden, and Iceland, where we have access to green energy in the form of geothermal and also hydroelectricity. So that reduces our environmental impact by using those renewable resources. Because we're using tens of thousands of computers, they generate a lot of heat. So we're trying to harness that heat that's excess and do good for the environment and the community by heating greenhouses, for example, so that they can grow their own vegetables, or also heat buildings that are adjacent to our facilities. As blockchain technology continues to revolutionize industries across the globe, it is expected to have a transformational impact on business over the next decade. Interesting enough, there's two types of coins that dominate the capital markets here. 
and that would be Bitcoin and Ethereum. And you're seeing all these new financial uh, contracts being created around Ethereum. So when JP Morgan went and launched their stable coin for crypto, they used the Ethereum algorithm. So the faster and bigger that that stable coin grows, the more Ethereum they're using. That now it's called DeFi, decentralized finance. That smart contract basically drops the cost structure, basically, and it takes out the broker. Well, they are also using the algorithm of Ethereum. As DeFi is booming, we have many big demands for Ethereum, and the stock market always rewards those with the fastest growth in revenue and cash flow, and Hive has been able to demonstrate that.